Hi everyone, it's Lisa and welcome. Today I'm making a one, two, three, very quick meal. And I am going to be using the Priano and this is the manicotti. And this is just gonna be something quick. And I wanted to share this with you because if you're in a rush, you might be going out somewhere. Maybe it's a day that you don't really have time to spend all day in the kitchen preparing a meal. This is just something really quick that your family can enjoy. Now I normally just buy the regular spaghetti. I buy the regular ravioli. I don't really get this kind of stuff like for lasagnas and pasta and stuff. But I saw this at Aldi. And I thought this would be great for a nice quick meal. And we are going somewhere, so I am going to go on ahead. I'm going to prepare this, I'm gonna wrap it, and I'll leave it, and when we come back home, all I have to do is put it in the oven. That easy and that quick. So, folks, I just gotta tell you what happened. This whole time I was filming, I was not filming. I forgot to hit the record button. So, this is what I'm gonna tell you. This is the manicotti, and that's what it looks like right there. So what I did was I put it inside my dish and I just lined them up. There's six of them. And then I added the and then I added the Prego sauce on top. And I also added some mozzarella cheese on top of the sauce. That simple, that easy. I so apologize that that happened. I cannot believe I did that. But that is the joy when you're making a video. Things like that happen, but I wanted to share with you anyway, because this is a really good dish. It's very quick. I'm going to go on ahead and wrap this with aluminum foil because we are going to, I'm going to go on ahead and I'm going to wrap this with aluminum foil. And when we get home, I'll just go on ahead and put it in the oven. And what's great about this, you can also make this for meal preparations and you can make it and then put it in containers and have it throughout the week for lunch or for meals, especially if you work outside, you're a homemaker like me, but yet you work outside of the home, okay? Because homemakers do work outside of the home. Some of them work inside of the home, some of them have to work outside of the home, so I do both. I work part-time outside of the home. So let's go on ahead and let's go on to the next thing. I just think some things are so funny, the way life is and the way things happen, but I do wanna share these field farm fresh peppers with you these are great and i love to use these they are great when you're making eggs you're making omelets you're making something quick and you just want quick peppers to cut them up really quick and put them in your omelets i love using these peppers for hash browns i love using these peppers even if you just want them with a little bit of ranch on the side and some tomatoes these are great these, they have them, I guess, if you go to Walmart, they have them at Walmart. If you go to Aldi, they have these at Aldi. These field and farm fresh peppers are really, really good. I love the really pretty, vibrant colors of these peppers. They are just so pretty. It's what they look like. They are just really beautiful. Now, I do use green peppers to cook. I use green peppers to make stuffed shells. But you can also put cheese in these. You can also put these with a little bit of sauce and cheese on top and put these in the oven, and they come out absolutely delicious. So I'm sorry we lost some of the footage there to my video. But yes, the manicotti is very easy to make. Like I said, just lay it out in your dish, put some sauce and cheese on top, wrap it up, and when you're ready to cook, it's ready to go in the oven. And this is the sauce that I use. This is the Prego Traditional. I do like the sauce that has the mushroom. I like the mushroom sauce. You know, all different kind of sauces I like to use for those kind of dishes. And you can also save the jar when you are canning you can save these jars i don't know if you can still use the lid you might have to get another lid but the jars are great for canning for all those who can so god bless you i hope you have a great day and i hope you enjoy these quick tips to making a quick meal have a wonderful day bye